Hello, it's Mr. Sander from Family Martial Arts, and I'm here to do like a quick video uh, to help those people that miss sparring and they feel like it's missing from their their training. So before I've done a video where I was I was throwing shots and you was you was working the covers, and there's one way of doing it. There's another way of doing it where you just all use your imagination. <laughs> um, so, I know it sounds a little bit weird, but uh, studies have been proven or done that have had uh, there was a basketball team they split the team in two and they had them practice a jump shot a certain setup for the shot um, physically on one side on the other side they imagined that they did it okay? and then both sides were able to do the exercise because your brain doesn't differentiate between uh, what you've actually done and what you imagined you've done it doesn't necessarily mean that you imagine you're going to be flying you're going to be cruising around the room, but if you're imagining something reality based and you're thinking about it in individual steps, uh, you will be able to accomplish it a lot easier because you, you've drilled it in your head already before it comes to the time when you need to use it. So you, I want you to find something like a nice relaxed area where you can close your eyes, even before you go to bed. Just before you go to bed, you close your eyes. Now it might not be the best time to do it, maybe when you wake up, because like if you're doing it, and you get your heart rate going and stuff like that, if your imagination is pretty good, then uh, you're going to stay up a little bit longer. So I say, do it when you wake up. So as you've woken up, you're like, okay, I'm in bed, I'm going to close my eyes, I'm going to imagine I'm fighting the toughest opponent I've ever fought before in my life. Or it could just be, uh, it happens to be Mr. Tanner. <laughs> just joking. Or it could be, uh, it could be anyone or anything. Um, but you imagine that they're throwing a shy, you remember, so that they throw and, like jab across, you dodging either way, your parrying's on point, you can throw your counter strikes and your hands move faster than they normally do move because nine times out of ten you've got another gear that you haven't reached yet. So you know, I say in like gears in a car, so you've got low gears and it's slow and it moves up and you get quicker. So uh, it, if you imagine you've got that gear already and you're punching even faster than you normally do, Maybe when you come back to train or when you're training at uh, uh, home and you throw these shots then, that you're punching faster than you thought you could because there's more in you than you, you know. Okay? So, close your eyes, visualize the opponent and spar them. And also you can add extra opponents as well. You can spar two, three, four people. You can try and fight an army if, you're, uh, if you can process that many people. Um, but try and do it in, in real time. I guarantee you you will improve if, if you do this. But you've got to take it seriously. Okay, so let us know how you got on on uh, visualizing your enemies. Uh, if you want, you can give them weapons, see if you parry the weapons, disarm the weapons, anything. The sky's the limit because your imagination. Right, let us know how you get on, and I'll see you in the next video.